Hi kittens, it's me Louise, I hope you're all doing well. Welcome to this video or welcome back to my channel. If you haven't been here before, I suggest you subscribe because I post new chaotic doi, doi, doi and doll ready content every single Wednesday and we do put this videos on Saturdays. So make sure you stick around. Today, welcome to July's haul. So I do these hauls because filming them in clips because it's easier for me. It's like vlogs, but yeah, hauls. So today is July 1st and we went to this second hand shop that just, op just opened up in my city and I found a lot of items. So I'm gonna show that to you now. Uh, what should we start with? I guess I gotta retain my audience. So sorry about the doll. <laughs> This Nikki doll, uh, I looked up how she's some kind of rainbow fashionista Nikki. She does sadly have cut and gluey hair, so I might cut it off and re root it. What do you think I should do with her? She's very pretty. Her nose has a little ship, but it's nothing that bothers me. I love fashionistas and I love my C dolls. Like, those are my favorite doll lines to collect. I mean, like the 2010 fashionistas. I mean, the, the normal ones I like too, but no, it's not my absolute favorite ones. So. And I found this wig, which I think is a live doll wig. Like it was, it was in a drawer, like a national drawer. And I only saw this part sticking out like this. I was like, pulled it out. I was like, is it Dracula? No, it's a wig. I'm like, oh, well, I'm taking that wig. Cause I know this fit monster high, I think. Let me see. I have a, I have a monster high fakey right here. So I, I'm pretty sure live wigs fit monster high dolls. Maybe need to modify it. I mean, she does have normal hair, but yeah. And I think they're a little bit, little bit big for Barbie-sized dolls. I mean, they could fit, but they look just kind of cute. But they're very like, yeah. Oh, you're back. That's my, that's my mini doll. <laughs> you don't know. Uh, but yeah, wig. I'm just gonna put this stuff next to me because this is my cleaning room. And we also got the fact that I'm splatter. This is Emma Emil's little sister. I wanted it because I do want to get these siblings for my the LLs I have, the OMGs and the twins. So this is her sister. She's only missing her hair bow. I'm not sure if her hair is cut, but I am going to fix her up so she can have her normal hairdo. So she's kind of like a wild child, but she does have her shoes and her dress. And apparently she has a color change gimmick. That's cool, I guess. Uh, my partner picked these up. These are four little mini coasters who's like oh for tea bags well, that's perfect because we have tea bag stuff but they're so old um we have found this fright mare actually so i picked her up i don't have any fright mares so we have this one hey everything is pink and black pink and black hair pink and black hair with the wig <laughs> but yeah so she is uh, me with me i found this trixie pony my little pony trixie Figure, so I think I'll pick her up as well. A little pain shift, but I can fix that. And I do have this. This is the Ferris from uh, Sleeping Beauty. I think this was really cool. It would fit well in my Disney collection. I don't think I have any Sleeping Beauty items actually, because I don't like that. I mean, I liked the the movie, but. Yeah. Cute as all glittery here. I don't know if the person that had this glitter I think so because it's on the outside but anyway it's pretty cool yeah I think they had it yeah so it's three fairs from Sleeping Beauty and now we come to quite an interesting thing that you probably didn't expect I have like a bunch of fantasy figures some are slash some are not this doesn't have any marking on it but this one was so cool I couldn't resist. This is super light, doesn't weigh anything. And these beautiful rainbow wings, like look at this gradient. This is so pretty. It's like solid in the back. This is more like translucent. Oh, it's so pretty. And look at the gold details here on the tail. And look at the frog feet. That is so cute. Even the little hands have stuff like that. This is so cute. Yeah, so. And I found this. It's cute kitty. It's cute little long tail kitty. I mean, it's a wildcat. I don't remember what it's called now. But yeah, this one. This one. This little baby. It's a baby boy. Or a baby girl. Baby kitty. 
and these are for my brother it's a bunny and i think a hair i'm gonna give those to him so it's a slash and these are four old slash the last four items showing you right now so i have this kind of like deer creature it's really cool it's like fur and leaves it has this beautiful markings on the head these are really cool like we do usually like if my brother and i are out together we go to the toy shop we will stare at these like schlesh animals and be like oh they're so expensive these were so cheap they were like 50 cents each for the small ones and a buck for the big ones it's like yeah give them all to me so we have this little creature it has a little tail like that it's a grayish blue gray and white fur we have a pink unicorn with a short tail that looks like that has some kind of draping on this some kind of knot there on the back very cute very unicorny and then my favorite one <laughs> it's like a koala it's so cute and the colors are gorgeous look at this little baby look at the toe beans you see these are so cute they had more animals but no fancy ones and then the last thing i'm going to show you for this clip i picked up a puzzle this was the most um expensive item this was five bucks i paid 18 for all this yeah it was a steal of a deal look at this beautiful wings puzzle so my 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 plan with these puzzles is to eventually at some point build them and glue them to like a backside and then have them as art wall art so yeah that is my plan that's it for this clip see you in the next one hi kittens it's me again what did i say the intro again i don't know but <clears throat> let's continue lies hall oh i'm tired uh we got back home on friday day is sunday but yes so the first thing i want to show you is this little um what called monster high mini ghouls oh god i'm name black on the name right now this is a rochelle just up as a little lemon she's so cute she even has a little wings she almost looks like a little fruit bat yeah it's really cute into the wash <laughs> into the wash she goes that sounds so mean to say but yeah um i do also oh gosh have this package here that i picked up Ooh. And this is Shane. This is Shane order. Say what you want. Um, I ordered a swimsuit. Very cute swimsuit. Um, so I decided I needed a second swimsuit because I only have one. And I was like, ah, I can't need a second one. So we have a ski little cute two piece suit. Like that's all. Very cute, but it was adorable. Yeah, yeet. And oh yeah, I got some stickers. Let's see if I can collect all of them at once. So this is some kind of like that double head thing, double sided tape thingy. I figured it would be useful. Oh, it's so warm in here, but I wanted to put a shirt on because I didn't want to film in my nightgown. Oh, no, 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 no. You got to pick a free item, I got a little makeup bag. This is always good to have a little toilet bag, so whatever you want to call it. I got here three sets of markers. These are all the colors they have. So we got a blue, purple, green, blue, and a pinkish peach set. I might do a video on this if you guys want to see it. I know I do most toy content, but some art stuff could be fun too. That is fun. Put them over there. Let's see what have we got here. Clothes. I ordered two pair of shorts, a versus jacket, and some other stuff. So this is a pair of shorts. Yes, it is. Perfect. With pockets. Good. I don't have any shorts. I know it's weird. I don't have any shorts. Really weird. Boom. This is the second pair of shorts. No, this is a shirt. I ordered the work shirt. What shirt I could use for work, I figured. Um, upside down. Because I recently did like a clean out and 
got rid of old shirts and stuff that I didn't want or that was broken. So yeah, it's just a black t-shirt with a bit of knitting pattern, yeah, whatever. Boom. And this is the second pair of shorts done. Yes, it is the second pair of shorts with pants and with pockets. Like, pockets you can actually still wouldn't wear my phone in this going on a ride. The thing is, I ordered this before we went on our vacation. It came the same day as we left, and it came after we had left. So I was like, well, it's time to pick it up. When we're back home, luckily I didn't need any shorts on the vacation because it was kind of rainy all the time. It wasn't short weather. So I guess that was a win. Right, this is the first jacket. Or Leatherman jacket, whatever you want to call them. I don't remember the term, but I wanted one of these for a long time because they look so nice. So this is a black and white one with a P on it. Just like that. Awesome, perfect now. This is a t-shirt <laughs> that I had to get because you'll see why. <laughs> this is ta -da -ta -da, opening a portal. Portal to the cat dimension. I love this kind of shirts. This style is so fun. It's just a bunch of cats. And the witch kind of looks like Sabrina from Teenage Witch. So yeah, very cute colors. Very cute. And other uh, nightmares. Yeah, cat dimension and other nightmares. Why would a cat dimension be a nightmare? It just sounds awesome to me. Ah, this is a laundry bag, laundry basket. Boom. That is for this bag. Well, yes, but I'm also going to show you the stickers that I got in it. So we have. <laughs> it's like there's a girl in a heart rib cage. And we have these. Kitty, three eyed kitty cats, purple with a ribbon. This guy, you can't even see it. It's just hidden behind little stickers on the packaging. She's a little kitty. Yeah. This is a Korean type of garb. Yeah, very cute. We have a rib cage with flowers. Oh, sorry, I'm holding it upside down. Boom. Got a devil girl, a demon girl, and a kitty with a moon. It's forehead. Meow. Very magical. Very magical. Oh, I guess I should just continue. I will continue. Oh boy. Yeah, if you don't know, we went to this um like outlet, low price store, whatever you want to call it. It's like a huge, huge store. I like, think dollar store, but like much, much bigger. And they have, you know, cheaper items generally. Um, I'll, I'll talk about more that when I come to the, that section. But we also went to one of the, um, they had an outlet, a Pandura outlet, which is we don't know Panduro is like a craft store here in Sweden, so I bought this little iron-on bunny. This is my brother, I'm gonna give it to him <laughs> on Friday. And then I bought a bunch of clay, female clay. So we got some junior glitter clay. I cannot wait to get started with all the clay again. I just want to work with this straw. Some colors, like purple and a teal, dark teal. We have a black and white. We have a brown and a glittery one. Ooh. Can you see it being glittery? Ah, oh, it's just me, it says glitter and text on it, so. And we have a yellow and blue. 
I figured I'd try and get some basic colors. You can mix them and black and white you always need, so. And then we have this like peach color and this light, uh, I guess we call it mint or seafoam green. And last but not least, this cold tape I got. It's like a yellow um, iridescent tape. That was cool. Paper tape it says, self-adhesive. Is that what I got from Pandora? Yes, it was. Bada bim, bada boom. And uh, yeah. Where is my remote? I will be back when I have put this away and going with the other package. <laughs> so this was a Trader purchase. Trader is a Swedish eBay site, and I bought. Okay, I guess I use this as a packing tip. I bought a lot of Equestria Girls dolls. So this is the full set. I think of the first year. Some are don't have the right clothes, but we have. Oh, yeah, they need some TLC. This is Fluttershy. Very cute. Her hair is so dry. Does this have nylon or is it probably properly? It feels like nylon. But it needs some TLC, definitely. I think, is this, no, this is not her right outfit, I think, because this is a half and half print. But I'll have to look it up. I'm pretty sure the shoes are hers, though. Yeah, all right, so Fluttershy. We have Applejack, who is wearing, I think, her right outfit. Oh god, yeah, this is nylon hair. This is all tangled up. Uh, I don't think the bow is hers. Um, and the shoes. No, the shoes might be hers, maybe not for this doll, because it has a stamp under them. Another one of the Rainbow Rocks lines came with like stamping shoes, but are they good fit? They are actually a good fit, so I don't know. I have to look it up if that's her correct shoes or not. <laughs> Sunset Shimmer, my third Sunset Shimmer. Yeah, she's having all her stuff. I think she's missing a bracelet, but that's her correct shoes. I know that because I'm looking at mine on the shelf. Yep. Right, this could actually move on the... They have articulation in the elbow, that's true. We have a Twilight, who definitely isn't wearing her outfit. This is some kind of cheap Barbie outfit. But, I mean, that means I can make her something, or I can figure something else to style her in. Okay, free Twilight. She has a ponytail. She doesn't have her glasses, but that's fine. Yeah, this is not her dress, and there's like some tied in a little. What's it called an apron around it? She doesn't have any shoes. Yeah. Again, hair needs some TLC, some somewhere similar TLC, but yeah. TLC do have been well loved, which is cute. Oh, okay, we come with a hat. Someone's made a hat for them. <laughs> We have the one, the only Rainbow Dash. I'm pretty sure this is her OG outfit. No, she's wearing Sunset Shimmer skirt. But the shirt is definitely hers. Top, I don't know. Hair is like this. Shoes. I don't know if those are hers or not. My cat wants attention. Dad's home and he's downstairs, but he wants my attention. Trying to get another hat. Okay, cute. We have Pinkie Pie, who is not in her real outfit. Pretty sure it's not a Pinkie Pie. I think these all came with like tops and skirts or shorts or something, but yeah. Cute Pinkie Pie. Oh, I'm gonna curl her hair. It's gonna be so fun. Really cute Pinkie Pie. Cute. And then we have. Rarity, who is also not wearing her correct outfit. <laughs> but there she is, very pretty. Also again, hair needs help. It's a little dirty, I mean they're all a bit dirty. Especially you can see the rarity because she has a white uh, white coat, so cute cute dress though, I like this dress, very cute. I wonder if it's a Barbie one, or if it's like a knockoff one. Oh, can't see anything. But I will make a TLC video on my box I have over here, so we do. That was all of them. Mm. 
All right. So we also went to uh, Liseberry, which is a amusement park. <laughs> And we also went around in Gothenburg, so, and on to the museum. So, Elizabeth first, we got a magnet. This is called Elizabeth's Bala, which is like a roller coaster. Very cute, can put this on the fridge. I got these socks. Semler. If you don't know what a semler is, it's a sweet treat with the cream and often like almond paste inside. Some have apple sauce as well. We also went to Universeum which is like a whole experience thing that's like they have a whole rainforest habitat they have fishes and other things that live in the sea and some sharks and stuff like sweet water fish I guess as you say they also had a bunch of stingrays I bought this little stingray at the gift shop because he's so cute his name is Ray the Rocker my brother named him so he looks like this is very pretty he's very cute stingrays are amazing I love them and we went to two thrift shops. One only had clothes. I was like, yeah. One had some dolls. I had this um, first edition Sunset Shimmer. She came like this. Her shoes are glued on. I need to like heat them up and take them off. Someone painted her leg. So I guess matched this leg. Her hair is really pretty and soft because it's nylon hair. So yeah, but I'm going to restore her the best I can. So I tried getting the shoes off and I can't. They are glued on, I think. Santa Jimmer, my favorite character. Right. And then we also went to SF Bookhandlen, which is like this big you know, like bookstore, nerd store that they have in Malmö, Gothenburg and Stockholm. And I bought these two books. So we have A Whole New World and Reflection. This is like what happens if you know, this is what, what if stories basically. Uh, they didn't have part of your world, like I wanted that one. Um, you can see here, this is Ursula. And there's some other ones here. But it's fine, maybe I'll find because they had it as a, like a hardcover book. But I want pocket books because they're smaller, easier to port portable and just, you know, deal with overall. So that's that. Why did you have a red thread on you? Sorry. And I toss that thread right out into the trash. The trash, the trash, my friends. This, I got this tote bag. Uh, the yoga only works in Swedish, sadly. Um, so this is a local artist in Gothenburg who has her own shop and she does everything herself. So she printed. It's a high quality print. This one says. Blesk Fisk. Uh, I'm not gonna describe it to you. Can you see it? Yes. Uh, so it's an octopus, obviously. Octopus, the Swedish name is Blekfisk, which is ink fish basically. Blesk is um, an old Swedish word for soda or pop or whatever you want to call it. And since Swedish is le um, soda is called Lesk. Also, so it's L A. SK so squid plus soda fish and he's drinking uh, the soda so you can see that it's pretty cool I liked it uh, my partner also got one but he got one with a whale on it uh, which was a bar whale <laughs> bar bar yeah it's fun um, that's a new tote bag. I do like tote bags. I use them a lot, so I am happy with that. And last but not least, oh boy, oh boy, we come to the big one, oh boysy. This is um, we went to Ullared. If you don't know what that is, it's like it's like I just told about a big low price giant store. Some things are cheaper, some things are not, but it's really big. They have cheapest freak toys, like cheap compared to Swedish prices. Uh, so I'm gonna show it to you and tell you how much everything costs. So I got. A second to her Meyer because uh, mine didn't it wasn't complete when I bought her I bought her out of the box so uh, so mine doesn't have her when well, she's missing like the she's missing the belt and I think these socks I can't remember right now and something else but also these pins are nice to freestyle and I might want to dye them 
so yeah she was uh, 15 dollars compared to what she costs in stores here which is like 50 dollars i'm not even joking 50 or more so what, the, what the, you buy rainbow high for if you can find a store that sells rainbow high it's only one i know so far that sells them um, because the other store used to have them don't have them anymore and in those stores they were like 60 each so yeah i only bought her they also had daria uh, from series three and from series two they had crystal karma and the ripper I have all them already. I don't want any extra other pieces. I mean, if you, if they had had Emmy, I would definitely bought the second Emmy, but they didn't have her. So her handle broke when I was carrying her. So I was like, well, at least they have handles. There was some Barbie stuff, but I didn't pick any of them up. There we go. Now she's fixed. So second show, I got Spirit Queen. She was twenty, which. In normal cases, she costs. I mean, Amazon she's like 21 or something, um, and in store she's like 600 or uh, 60 or more. Uh, so yeah, that's the thing. I got Spirit Queen. Let me know if you want me to unbox her on a camera, because I will probably do that. She's such a cool box. I love the movie Magic Dolls. It's the only one I have. I want her, and I want the. What's it called? Galactic Bay, wait, Gamma Babe. Yes, Gamma Babe is your name. Gamma Babe. I did also see um, Mr. Rec that store. But yeah. So she's going into my unboxing review pile. There's a lot of them down there. And I got Ferocious of the Music Mix Supersonics. They didn't have any other ones. They only had Ferocious. And she was. or 20 can't remember but very cheap as I said usually she's like 60 and yeah and this is the first version not the one with the, the like lower quality um, production that came out later I do want to get the other ones too especially uh, Metallic and Bad Girl Thank Queen I'm okay but you know so cool so this is my second one of the music remix ones because i also have a video on uh punk girl and rocker boy so i'll link that for you to watch and enjoy and the last doll i got nia regal she was 15. um i love the twins they're so cute i absolutely adore them i'm gonna make a video on these two i do have emma from the same series already there's no unboxing of her because of what happened last year when we were in Germany, so yeah. But I did want to get Renia because she's such cute, like her hair is amazing. She has like this completely braided hair. She's adorable. So I just picked the first one that I saw and I see none of her baby hairs aren't lined up with her scalp, but it's not really in the picture either, so I guess it's fine. It won't bother me too much. She's so cute. That's Nia. Okay. Once I get my other shelf, I can go back to reviewing toys again. And okay, you don't need to see that. That's some personal hygiene stuff. That's some pads. That's all you need to know. Oh, oh my god. I got <laughs> this um, sweater. This purple sweater. Because you know that I like purple. If you don't know it, it's my favorite color in my family. So here we go. Beautiful knitted fabric. Cute. Right. Oh. <laughs> I was confused for a second there. I got two new work shirts, just basic black shirts with a V neck on them. And yeah. Then I got underwear. <laughs> then I got underwear. Panties. <laughs> uh, yeah. That's a
this is underwear. Yeah, that's a new underwear. Uh, I got eyebrow uh, knives, I guess uh, shavy knives, like for eyebrows, because they're good for styling all hair. Yes, I never do anything about my eyebrows, because I don't care. I pluck them twice, when I was younger, that's it. Shave them a bit sometimes, but yeah. And I also got some mini brands, so I have this one, and the Disney one. So this will be featured in the upcoming blind box video, once I have 10 items, I should do a blind box video. I think I have three items now, or something. Something like that, yeah. And... Hmm... Yeah, that is it for now. I'll show you some clips of more stuff. I also got this tray. It's like... You can turn it wee! So good, because I didn't have anything here earlier, and I was like... Well, the tray or something, and I found a spinning one, so perfect. Got this box. No, but I built it actually already. Ah, it's up there. It's a wildflower bouquet. It's a Lego one. Very cute. Very nice. I really like it. And my partner got the bonsai tree, so he built this one. Oh yeah, I guess Gigi was part of the July haul as well. Or maybe June, I can't remember. So you get to see Gigi lamp. Uh, and then the little crown up there, the ground, green one is also for the bonsai tree and it's, um, I mean you can switch the crowns around but this one, look, it's pink frogs! it's so cute, I love this one, it's so adorable the bonsai tree is really cool I do really like mine too, the the wildflower bouquet is really pretty, it was really fun to build I love lupins, one of my favorite flowers actually, this one this with the purple and pink oh, it's so cute so, I have this doll, as you can see, this Barbie, she is the rainbow sparkle hair, and this is the, I guess this only comes in this version. I don't know why, but I've been obsessed with her, like, for forever since I saw her. I was like, why? And I figured out why. It's because she reminds me both of hula hair Barbie and glitter gel Barbie from the 90s. I'll put in a picture on the side here, but... I think that's why. I also really like her rainbow hair. She's really pretty. She will not be getting unboxing because I'm gonna unbox her right now because I want to do that. So yeah, here she. Is. Hello. Yes. Um. Some more July stuff I got. Um. In my first creatable world fashion pack. I also said I have ordered a second one, not the same one, but different one. Because this one is so cute with the rain set. Don't know if I showed. I can't remember. We went thrifting on Friday, found these two paintings. So this is the Victorian Flower Garden, summertime, absolutely beautiful. This is super light, I'm gonna have them on my flower wall in the living room. This is the Victorian Flower Garden's Summer Retreat. So these were the two that I found. I also have these. This is the backings for earrings, like the ones you clip on. I've been looking for stuff like this. They had more, but these two were the fullest bags, and they all had the same price. I was like, I'm not gonna pay the same for all of them. This is about two dollars. Yeah. We have a pile of stuff. We have a pile of stuff. I'm going to show you the pile of stuff. I ordered some Monster High Minis because they had this Prime Day. So this is mostly Prime Loot Day, except for the last item. But yeah, I ordered this set. So that's it, this has been 72. I had ordered another set, but I'll put a picture of it on the screen. So hopefully I can get that. I this set. These were all pretty cheap. They were under 20 each. So and this set. I love the most Rahimis, they're so cute. But each of them come like this, and it's like, yeah, the packaging is basically falling apart. Right, I also got this Barbie Extra. There will be a review on her. Might be up by the time you've seen this video. I don't know. It will be titled something like Sailor Moon as a Barbie. Because this one gives me so many Sailor Moon vibes. Or Uzagi, I should say. With the hair and the color choice, this is screaming Uzagi core. That's the word now. <laughs> so those are all like Prime Loot. Prime, Prime Day Loot. And also the Rainbow Barbie you saw earlier, Rainbow Hair Barbie. Very wrong color. This is also what we got from a second hand shop. This was nine bucks. This is entire Star Galactica DVD box. So yeah, the complete series. Yahoo, baby. Today is the 18th of July. 
I ordered this shirt for Happy and I figured I would try it on Sassy because they're about the same size and she looks so cute. <laughs> but she's so confused. I didn't put it around the the leg thing because they're supposed to, like they are little things that are supposed to go around the legs and over the butt. But oh my god. Sassy, look at mama. Hey honey. Yeah. <laughs> it's so cute. I got another fashion pack for Creative World because I had to. These are so cute and they're actually very affordable on Amazon. So, yeah, this is my favorite piece, I think. The yellow shirt. It's so cute. Yeah. Adorable. Oh, that's also very pretty. It's a skirt, nose pants, shorts, awesome sauce. Hickies. Boop. He took shut off it. Bye. Welcome to the last part of the whole video, everybody. So, we went thrifting on Saturday, my family was here. I want to show them the new thrift shop that we have here. And this is what we got. Hello, Vincent. He's overseeing and making sure I do the right thing here. So, we got two yarn. This is like a very soft pastel purple. Can doesn't quite show up the right color. It's more vibrant in real life. This is a mixed yarn with some shiny threads in it. Also pink and purple. And I actually found this in the box, so I was looking. This is um, the River Sticks Anklet. So, River Sticks from Haunted, I mean, you can't really see it. You can see the top of her head there, between Abby and Dracula. But yeah. And I did see this Sherry really last time, but I didn't pick up her up, but now I did. But this coloration between her, her head and her body is interesting. And then I found this little pet shop poodle, which I don't think I have. Pretty cute. This doll was also there last time. This um, Disney fairy doll is her name, Silver Miss. So I'm completely in the right, wrong here. We'll see. She came like this. She doesn't have anything, and you know, no wings or anything. So. Because I think she's a, I don't think she's a wing stall. No, no, she has pointy ears. She's probably a Disney doll. Uh, and then this Barbie from the 2010s. Because <laughs> I like these ones with the articulation. I mean, she doesn't have the wrist articulation, but also, I mean, obviously her hair needs a fix, so we'll take care of that. It's also very gluey. Vincent is coming inspecting. Hello, sir. Please don't eat her. But yeah, otherwise she is looking fine. And yeah. So all of this together cost me like seven bucks. <laughs> Mista. Mista Flov. But yeah, that is it for this um for say, July um haul video. If you all made it to the end, thank you so much for watching. And we have a secret here. So if you did make it to the end, leave a B emoji in the comments. And let me know what your favorite thing was that I found this month. And yeah, he's sitting on them. <laughs> but yes, don't forget to sacrifice the comments to the Hungry Hungry algorithm. And I will see you in my next video. Stay creative. Bye!